Mario Kart Wii expert staff ghosts. They're not the toughest thing in the world, so I came up with this challenge. When I beat a staff ghost, I have to use its vehicle character combination for the next track. So when I beat Luigi Circuit, I have to use Luigi Mach on Moo Moo Meadows. And then when I beat Moo Moo Meadows, I have to use Baby Daisy Bullet Bike for Mushroom Gorge, and so on and so forth, until we get through all 32 tracks. Now, you're still thinking, that sounds really easy. Well, that's what I thought too, going into it. Actually, my original goal was to beat every track in this way on my first attempt. And you could probably tell by the way I'm kind of dragging this out, that that is not what happened. This was my mentality going into race one. I've tested this with the first two tracks, and it seemed like it was going to be pretty easy. This was my mentality on race four. Oh my god, it's Jover. I can't do it. And this was my mentality on race six out of 32. Dude, is this one just going to be impossible? Like, I just lost so much time. Oh no. Honestly, most of this challenge isn't even that bad. When you get to use a good vehicle or the staff ghost you're racing against just isn't very fast, they're pretty easy to beat. But when you get that brutal combo of a bad vehicle versus a hard staff ghost, that's when things start to seem like they're impossible. One last thing before we start, I was using this Switch Pro controller because I was on Dolphin uh, instead of my usual Wii Nunchuck. It just ups the difficulty a little bit more. And this ended up being quite the undertaking to the point where I honestly wanted to give up multiple times. So did I actually give up or did I complete the challenge? Find out right now. Let's start up this challenge. I don't know how challenging it's going to be. Um, I've tested this with the first two tracks and it seemed like it was going to be pretty easy. But you never know when you get to the weirder vehicles how challenging it's going to be. Now, to up the ante, I am using this controller on Dolphin, which is a Switch Pro controller. And normally I use the uh, Nunchuck and Wii Remote. Now, the difference between the two being with the Nunchuck, the D-pad or the uh, joystick has notches in it, which helps you soft drift. Basically, it just helps you drive better, faster, stronger. And, oh god, this might be harder than I thought. And, um, when you trick with the Wii Remote, you have to shake it while on this controller, this Pro Controller, basically. You just have to hit the D-pad and get a trick out. You also have to hit the D-pad for wheelies as well. And normally, I'm used to just shaking the shit out of my Wii Remote at all times. So, I'm going to instinctively do that a couple times in this challenge. See, so you see how far ahead we are, like, these first couple of, these first couple of ghosts, which you get to use mock bike and bullet bike and whatever, they're gonna be pretty easy. And I mean, even if we messed up that shortcut, look, look, I'm messing up the shortcut, I'm in the damn dirt. Still clearing, like, did this guy even use his mushrooms? I don't know. Easy win, but now, this is where the challenge really starts. Gotta switch over to Luigi Mach for the next race. Okay, now we're racing against the bullet bike. And this is going to be another aspect of the challenge, switching between all these vehicles. They all have different drift stats, different uh, ways that they take turns. You have to get used to it. I mean, if I make a mistake here, like this guy seems like he's pretty fast. But if I make a mistake and drift too tight because I'm not used to mock bike drift, then I might hit the wall and completely ruin everything. You know, on the later tracks where I actually have the chance to fall off, that's where things get really interesting. Also, I know that I'm pretty sure the Rainbow Road uh the rainbow road expert ghost uses the jet setter and then like the gv2 ghost is actually hard or something i don't know we'll get to that i actually have not tested that out or looked at it at all those are just two things that i rem vaguely remember so i'm kind of hoping that it ends up being true just to actually give me like a pretty good challenge oh give me that low trick though weave in between the monty moles <sighs> not quite not quite Look, look how much of a lead I have. These aren't much of expert staff goes now. I guess I'm only out by a second, so let's not mess this lap up. Easy peasy. Now we gotta use Baby Daisy Bullet Bike on Mushroom Gorge, which... I don't know, Mushroom Gorge... Stuff can go wrong on that track pretty easily, so let's see. Alright, well, uh... I had no idea what vehicle the Mushroom Gorge goes to use, and it turns out it is a cart. So I am fully expecting to completely dog walk Toadette in the cart, unless I fall off. And honestly, even if I do fall off, I think I can still beat him. But we're, we're going for a gap jump three for three, by the way. We're going for gap. Oh my God. 
Crap. That was a lot closer than I thought it was gonna be. That's what I mean. Baby Daisy's drift on bullet bike is ridiculous, but I'm not used to taking it at that type of angle. Oh jeez, man. See, I'm trying to like claw. You can claw on the uh, the pro controllers, and you can like drive and get your chain wheelies out and shit better. Oh my god. Okay, dude. This is what I'm talking about. I have no control over my vehicle. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> okay, 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 lock in. Uh, I genuinely don't think I can beat this ghost now. I am two seconds behind. He is going to do the grass cut at the end. No! No! Dude! I lost on fucking Mushroom Gorge! Oh my god! I lost the challenge on the third race. And legitimately lost. I know I'm not, you know, I'm, I'm pretty good at this game. I'm not a god. I'm not like, I'm not Zeus level. I'm more like a demigod, like Hercules level. But still, new controller that I don't use. Plus Baby Daisy Drift, which I'm not used to. Okay, dude, we gotta make this 3 for 3, by the way. So easy, so easy every time. Honestly, that last loss is a fluke. Because, let's just be real. I could have just played it safe and went around the grass cut three for three and I wouldn't have fallen off and it would have been free, but I was just making things a little more interesting. All right, but we're not going to count that last one. All right, dude, I can't, I can't catch up. I can't catch up. I'm even further behind now than I was last time. I needed to trim this wall ride. It's the only way. I need to do streamless wall ride. Okay. Third time's the charm. All right, let's just say, uh, let's say we have three lives. How about that? I might have to go back and edit that. Give me three lives instead of first taking it every every time. Because we're not even out of the first cup, and I've already failed the challenge twice. All right, can we at least go three for three on gap? Like, see, that's that's the angle it needs to look like. Like, I need to take it at that weird. Super hard facing right at the angle. I can't with this track, man. Give me the good respawn. Thank you. Holy moly. Don't fall off. Okay, we're fine. We're good. Get me in that. Get me off of that track. I never want to play Mushroom Gorge again. Okay, well. I have not used a cart in a long time, but I'm racing against pretty terrible carts, so it should be fun. Or not, or I can just get completely outlined by Nin GQO off rip. Like, dude. I'm just gonna shroom. I don't even know, dude. He's like beating me. Should I shroom there? Like, if I really want to one take this, then I should have probably shroomed there instead of trying to risk. The shroom cut? Like, can I even make this? Oh my god, I don't... Dude! I'm gonna lose again. I'm literally about to lose again, because I'm terrible. I can't control my vehicle. Okay. I think we can still catch up. I'm not doing... The... We're done. It's over. Holy... Sh I can't do it. I can't do... Restarting. Wow. Wow. There we go. Yeah, he gets a full MT out there. Oh my god, man. I'm terrible. He's gonna get the one MT. Actually, maybe we, we're not fine. I don't know. Dude, what is up with this turn? Okay. I'm actually gonna lose again. Okay, I think I just need to risk Shroomless because I don't see a universe in which I'm making this. Hold on, hold on. Okay. No, nope, we're restarting, guys. We are officially restarted four times now. Still can't get the orange out. That's okay. We're not gonna mess up this turn. There we go. That's all we needed. Now we win. I mean, if you make it past that turn, you pretty much guarantee win. Oh my god. We can't catch up. It's fucking over, dude. Eh, we can catch up. We can catch up. We can catch up. It's Jover, dude. Oh my god, it's Jover.
I can't do it. I can't do it. I lose. Can't get a low on that. I don't even know if you can. I mean, I'm assuming you can. You can hop, so. Okay, we got this. All I need to do is just not mess up lap three. Okay, Stomper Cycle is completely fine. Let's not hit the wall in this turn like we did the first two times. All right, we're chilling, man. We are so chilling. Did I just do Shroomless for... I'm doing it, dude. I'm going for it. Just kidding. Psych! You thought? Never playing this track again. Ooh, get on the ramp, baby girl. Easy peasy. Only took me four tries, okay? And I'm just now realizing that I have to use Toad on the Blue Falcon for this next track. Like, how does this challenge keep getting harder? I genuinely thought it was going to be easy. What am I racing? Got yeah, the Sprinter? Wait, I can beat the Sprinter, right? How much faster is he going? Not going that much faster. Dude, how's my drift stat? Uh, it's not great, but... It looks like he's going for that terrible shortcut. I think we can beat the dog pretty comfortably. And we just get an empty here. Easy. Alright, this should be easy. If we can do that all three laps, we're fine. Okay, looks like the chain chomp cycle in lap two is going to be pretty free. It's my orange, but I already caught up to him, so we're chilling. Let's see. Okay, no, we're good. Chain chomp's over there. I just need to not, like, hit the wall or something. Hit the Goomba. Goomba's over there. Goomba's over there. We're good. We got this. One try, thank God. But now, I have to use Mario Sprinter. So, we'll see how that goes. Okay, I was a little bit scared at first. The Sprinter is pretty terrible, but this guy is also using a cart, so I think we should be fine. Oh, maybe not. The Sprinter is, like, so bad. Like, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. I'm just driving in the funky Flame Runner lines, and I'm losing time. Oh my god, is this one just impossible? Like... Dude, is this one just gonna be impossible? Like, I just lost so much time. Oh no. I'm so far behind, and I felt like I didn't drive that badly. Okay, there's only one thing I can do. Okay. I'm ahead barely, but... Why does he go so fast there? I don't get it. Okay, no, I, I, I'm taking that out. Like, you can see I'm restarting. I already know this is gonna be almost impossible. Why am I- why am I mi- I'm shrooming too early. Okay, what does he do here? Does he just drive? I guess that's just that much faster. Hold on, maybe I- maybe I solved it. No- no drift, just get in there. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Just hold on, we're going home. Come on, you can do it, Mario. Okay. Okay, we're learning, we're learning. Now... Oh, God, that's atrocious. How do I get up there? Okay, we're gonna try that again. Let's get a- get a bluey. Get a blowy in the- in the CM mall. Get a- Get a blowy in the... Coconut mall... Rift stop. Okay, whatever. I don't know what I was trying to say with that. <laughs> that joke died. I don't know where I was going with that. I don't know where I was going with that. Okay. I think we just do that. Oh, we need to hit that boost pad. That's fine. Maybe maybe trick here? That seems like decent. New tech. I have no idea what the car cycles look like, though. Okay. We can hit... Okay, we need to... We need to be on pace to hit the first and third boost pad. Here we go. Oh! Oh, baby! I'm fucking clean with it! Okay. I'm not gonna go for a mini turbo there. I feel like I always lose control of my bike. Oh! Oh, my god. So, I need to just handling into that. I think... I, I don't think I can drift into it. What if I empty early? I think if I just empty early and then go hard left handling, I think I can do it. We're live. We're live. We're live. Lap two car cycles. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Lap three. Oh, shoot. I am so dumb. 
That wasn't that bad, actually. Remember? This time we go up this way. Okay, that's a really bad angle to take that turn at. Okay, go for the yellow here. Or the orange, I mean. Ah! This is it. Michael Jackson, this is it. I don't know the last three car cycles. I'm going tight. I don't care. I'm going tight. Yep, we got it. No, we don't. Oh! <laughs> okay, get the orange out here. Oh, God. Bumper cars. Worth it, though? Hold on. That's fine. I mean, we still beat him by 0.5. You know what? I'm just going to do this again because it worked last time. Didn't really work that well this time, but it's fine. Remember? Right side. Yeah. Oh my, that is really bad landing. Okay. Get to start my drift up pretty early though. I just missed the boost pack completely. We could still do something here. Yeah, I need to go. Uh, I need to go wide. I need to go wide boost. It'll be open. It'll be open. Oh! I'm not messing around. I'm just going to go up this side. We got a nice, comfortable lead. Could be freebie, right? And I think I just go tight because I'm on a really fast pace. I'm way in front, so I just go tight here. Yep, nice. Nice. We did it. Okay, we did it. Wow. I really thought that was going to be impossible the first time I raced. Okay, of course. Completing Coconut Mall marked the beginning of a long stretch of tracks that were honestly free. DK Summit, even with the cart, is easy because you can just do the single cut every lap. Goldmine is a Flamefire Mirror Match, which isn't too bad. Then on Daisy Circuit, the Staff Ghost uses Daisy Mock, but it is slower than Molasses. From there, it's a six track long stretch where you get to use inside drifting bikes, and every one of these is a piece of cake. But the challenge picks up quickly when we circle back around to the Shell Cup. Okay, well, I just had the realization that Peach Beach is actually the first thing in this cup. Also, Yoshi Falls' expert staff goes to use the super blooper. I don't even know if that's right. I think it is, because I'm pretty sure I specifically unlocked the staff goes on this track. And GB2 uses the spear. Okay, this might be the end of the challenge. We'll see. I was gonna say, I'm just gonna do the uh, normal three or one, two, zero shroom strat, but I don't know if that's gonna be worth it. Maybe I'm shrooming too early? Do you not even cut off that much on the bike? I don't know. We'll just do one tree later. Going like there. Let's just go like here. It's not bad, right? The ducks don't target. Yeah, yeah. they only target you on uh, versus, man. I don't know if it's going to be worth the snake like that. Probably not, because the jet setter's best stat is its speed, so I should just drift. I should just drive head on. Okay. Two shrooms. Looks like he's doing the same thing. He. In Tycho. Okay, let's just drive head on. How much time am I losing? A little bit of time. And also I have no mushrooms. Okay, this could actually be bad. If they have one more mushroom, I think I'm screwed. Maybe I do just need to sneak. Make. I don't know why I keep saying sneak. Oh my god, look at the traction difference. Holy. See how far I went? Oh shoot, I think I could have won. You get the MT up pretty easily, so. I would assume it's faster. We got a nice little break. I hate that traction difference from the sand to the, uh, to the cobblestone, whatever that is. I think we're good, yeah, we're, that wasn't too bad. That was not too bad. Yeah. And we got Peach on the Dolphin Dasher versus the Super Blooper. Like I said, I don't even know if this is actually the expert staff ghost, because 
Like, I don't see how you could use the super blooper and get the fastest time for the staffs. Uh, also, apologies if the camera quality or anything is different. This is a different day and I had to, like, adjust all my stuff around for a little bit. This one should be pretty easy, though. Only a minute long track. Dolphin Dash is really easy to use. Alright, that was the easiest one yet. It only took me a minute. But now we gotta use the super blooper. I think. Let's see. Let's see if this unlocked the staff ghost. No, it didn't. Okay, so that's the fast staff ghost. Ghost Valley 2's expert staff ghost is considered one of the hardest in the game. And I had the unfortunate challenge of trying to beat it with the super blooper. I'm putting up a timer in the corner to show just how long this took. Take a guess in the comments or in your head on how long you think it's going to take me to beat. This was one of the hardest time trial endeavors that I've ever had to partake in. There's going to be a lot of resets. Okay, here we go. Okay, now this one, I have heard that this was the hardest staff ghost. And I'm on the super blooper. So I don't even know if this one's going to be possible. Like, off the jump... Okay, wait, that's a really good cut. Dude, no, no, this is gonna be hard. This is gonna be hard. I might have to, like, come up with some strats. I... Dude, I don't even want to do this one anymore. I already want to give up. Are you kidding me? I don't think I can beat this one. Like, genuinely, I do not think I can beat this one. Oh my gosh, man. I'm three seconds behind it. Four seconds behind it. How do I beat this? Might be doable. Dude, he's going so fast. That's where he uses his mushroom? Oh no, man. Can't get these stupid oranges out. I... I mean, I, I, I got an improvement, but... Dude, I'm like still two seconds behind. The shortcut is good, though. Like, it definitely saves a lot. Like, I need to do something like that, and it has to be fast enough. The only thing I can think of is just cutting off more with the shortcut, like, having perfect cuts 3 out of 3. Yet. I might need to start trying to get that low trick. I think that might be the only thing. I mean... I mean, it's something. I can't get it. Ugh. Not gonna save me point three, but like, oh man, I'm just getting closer. I'm still a second and a half behind though. Like none of my times are even close to getting to beating him. None of my splits. Like I can't even get a sub twenty second time. Ah, dude, I just got two 19-second laps. I don't know what to do on the last straight, though. I feel like getting the yellow MT like, has to be... Like, it has to be it, right? I have to get the yellow out. That's the only consistent thing, but, like, I need a better way to get it out. No, I missed my orange. Fuck. 
Oh, dude, I think I can beat it. Wow, I got a 59. Wow, dude. Let me see what the time is. Oh my god, 158.9, dude. I literally have splits to beat it. I literally have splits to beat this. Holy shit, okay. Yeah, 19 point... 19.6 second laps? That's enough, right? Oh, it's like gonna be close. You're gonna beat it. Dude, another PB. See? Look at that lap 3, though. I think the cut. I think I just have to get better cuts. Yeah, I don't know, man. Doesn't seem possible. No, oh, I missed the fucking orange again. Oh, yeah, I think... Fuck, man. I'm getting 19 second laps, though. I don't know, dude. It's so hard. Get that fucking MT out there. I think I hold left going into it, and then... At, like, after I shroom, I go hard right. Fuck, dude. Oh, yeah. Log in. Damn, man. I'm close. Hold on, let me see that last lap. Okay. Okay, I think I figured it out. Kind of. PB, I think. Yeah. Still, like, almost a full second off. Not less than a second. Less than a second. That was a really good cut. Oh my god, I beat him that lap. Oh my god, man. What was that lap one? 0.8? Damn, that was still enough to beat- wow. 0.6 lap three, bro. That's my fastest lap one ever. Dude, I don't think it's possible. I can't get lower than that, like... Can I- cause it's- I have to beat a point eight, So I have to shave 0.7 off. I don't think I can. That was a good lap 3. That was a good lap 1. And I'm not shaving 0.7 off of lap 2. Holy shit, that cut was clean. Oh my god, man. What was that lap one, dude? Oh, it's just another... Like, I don't know how I'm beating that. You see that cut on lap one, man? If I can do that on all three laps, is that going to save enough? I don't know if I can do it, man. I don't think I can. I've been saying that, but I don't think it's possible. I might have to go back and look to see how good that cut was. By the hour mark, things felt hopeless. I still hadn't even gotten close, so something had to change. I went back to look at the actual footage of me getting fast cuts in hopes that I could replicate it and learn how the good cuts were saving me so much time. And almost immediately after coming back, I got this run.
Shit. Oh my god, I had it! Point one. Oh, dude, I'm getting there. I'm so close! Ah! I can't believe I was that close, man. Oh, if I had the cut lap three, that was it. Oh, dude, now it's, it's possible, dude. It's definitely possible. This run proved it was possible, but it also did something to my mental. Because I knew that the run was possible now, I just wanted to complete it as soon as possible and get it over with. So every run that wasn't on pace and every reset was bringing me closer and closer to insanity. Dude, what the fuck? Shit. Let me see that time. Baby. That dun 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 dun. Or chicken bake or double chunk chocolate cookie. Point sevens, man. Need them point sixes. Need them point fives. Need them point fours. Come on, baby. Let's give it one. Empty here. No, I got the trick. Fuck. Fuck, dude. I think if I got the low trick, I would have got it. Oh no. Yeah, I mean, I lost, like, a shit ton of time with that air, but... Oh, I think I might have got it if I got low trick. That's what we do. We bring the boom. We bring the boom to you. We bring the boom. Yeah, dude, I... Are you kidding me? How fast was that lap? 0.5, bro. 0.5. I'm so close, dude. We bring the boom. That's what we do. We bring the boom. We bring the boom to you. We bring the boom. That's what we do. We bring the boom. We bring the boom to you. That's pretty good. Oh, yeah, that was really fucking good. Oh, almost hit the stupid brick on the left. Oh shit. Oh shit! Fuck, dude! That was such a good run. Fuck, that was the one. That was so ass. Oh, come on, man. Oh, we're so close, dude. Look at those splits. I can do it. I can do it. You can do it.
Oh my god! Oh my god, dude. Unable to create a ghost. I don't care. Oh my god, look at this point four, baby. Wow. I genuinely thought that wasn't going to be possible. I honestly thought that wasn't going to be possible. Like... Like, at first... I said it was impossible, but then, you know, I hadn't actually tried to learn any of the strats or anything. And then we got, like, a pretty good run. But I looked at the splits, and there were, like, 0.7s and 8s, and I, I thought I couldn't get better than that. Okay. It's done. It is done. That is... GV2, as fast as goes to beaten with the super blooper Yoshi. Keep moving. I don't even want to know how many attempts that took, man. I'm not going to count. I'm just going to maybe put a timer on it to see how long it actually took. Uh, my mouse is on the screen. <laughs> Whatever. This should be one takeable. Look at this. I'm on the spear. I got inside drift. This stuff goes It's easy. I'm going to do a little bit of that. Oh, man. It's just so easy, man. These wheelies. We're popping wheelies now. Getting little chain drifts. No, no orange MTs to worry about. I guess chain... Uh, I never thought about that. Chain drifting like that is like not worth it on the spear like at all. The mini turbo boost you get is terrible and you get sent even wider. So your drift gets even worse. But that is a one shot Mario circuit or Mario raceway. After I spent like two hours on the other track. Oops. Uh, you know what, we're just going to restart. I'm past the point of trying to one-shot these. I have n This is so weird. Like, I do not like this feeling. Okay, that cut seemed to be pretty much the same. Just a little spin drift hop. Ah! Alright. Should be fine. As long as we don't hit anything. It actually... Is I don't think the ghost is going to be hard to beat, but, like, just driving the track in general and not hitting the penguins and falling off and shit is going to be... Kind of annoying, but as long as we, you know, don't mess up, this should be pretty easy. And as I say that, I hit the penguin. But we still have a second lead on him, so could probably just keep going. And I'm in the wall. Ah, still kind of ahead of him though, so we're fine. In mind, and I still catch up after all these miss. Okay, I wish I had a speedometer. Dude, this thing drifts too tight. I hate this track, man. This is more annoying than GB2, because, like... I know I can beat this ghost. Like, very easily. It's just the track sucks at driving. Okay, yeah, I'm not swerving around in this cave anymore, man. I guess the Blue Falcon does have a higher speed stat, doesn't it? Dude, this thing is so annoying to drive with. Its drift is too good. Like, how? How am I supposed to use this thing? Just snake on this one. I can never get the stupid super out. There you go. See, it's so easy. This is my best lap. Just go around the penguin, get an orange out. Yeah, that was... A little close, I can't lie. I also almost just drifted off the track there. It's cool. And the penguin is in the same spot every lap. That's funny. Wow, I almost hit that. That's funny. Would not have been laughing, though. I would have been very upset. I think we got it. We got it. Go extra wide. Alright, thank god I'm off this track. That took way too many attempts, because honestly it was not that hard. Just driving on ice in an outward drifting cart with really good drift was very awkward. Okay, change character. Okay, well, I am on Luigi, Baby Luigi, Baby Luigi, Blue Falcon, and I am racing against a Magic Cruiser on Shy Guy Beach, dude. 
So I don't know how this is going to go. This might be another... Uh, we, we might be here for a while. Uh, why can't I just have a bike? Like, I, I let's see what he does. Okay, shrimps here. Hop over all these little guys. I'm close. I don't think I can beat it. I don't want to do this again, man. Oh, this track's so long too. How am I beating this? Someone tell me. I don't think I can do it, dude. I don't think it's possible. I don't want to do this again. I don't want to do this again. I don't think it's possible. This might be the end of the challenge, bro. I don't think this is going to be possible. Like, the super blooper one was hard, but at least the track was short enough. I, I gotta give it, like, a couple of attempts, you know. Okay, go around the tree. Like, dude, he's using the Magic Cruiser on Shy Guy Beach! I can't, man. I can't beat it. There's no way I can beat this, dude. I don't know if that's faster. I don't think it is. I give up, bro. I got no strats. I got nothing. I just, there's no way I can beat this. The only thing I can think of is if I get a super mini turbo in the shortcut spot and then save my shroom for. The... Oh, dude, that's... I was gonna say save my shrimp for this spot. Maybe. I mean, that's just not as big as a cut, though. I don't know. I'm gonna have to cook up something, because, like... There ain't no way I'm beating this ghost. Now, maybe I should even save my shrimp for the last corner, because... That little section is really awkward to drive in. About the same, almost. But I might be able to get a yellow out there. Alright, hold on. It's worth considering. I don't know about this strategy, man. I can't get this... I can't get the orange out, ever. Dude, I... I don't want to do this anymore, man. There's no way. I genuinely don't think this one's possible. Like, the other ones were at least close. This one is just, I'm so far away every time. Like, this part right here, I just don't see how I can beat them. Like, I just lose so much time right there. Yeah, I guess I'm ahead, that's weird. Maybe it is possible. I mean, I'll head that lap, so. Please hit the crab or something. Damn. Damn, man, that was the first actual, like, half-decent attempt. Is it possible? I mean, I, I was on pace lap one. And if I got the yellow mini turbo out, I would have been still ahead of him. No, I hit the... And I'm... A... Right, let's just finish this one out. See, And I accidentally using my mushroom i can't even see what kind of pace i was going to be on no ah. 
a good lap. Yes! Yes, dude! Oh, wow! Wow. Wow, 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 dude. That, I'm not kidding. Like, I genuinely thought that was going to be impossible, too. Like, I wasn't even getting good splits or anything. Like, lap one was so difficult. I'm in the damn blue falcon. I cannot believe I actually did that. The, out of all of them, that was the most surprising. Like, GV2 was the hardest. But, and it took the most attempts. But that one was actually fun because you could get laps really quickly. And it was like, I was basically discovering new strats along the way. That one, it felt like I kind of knew what I had to do from the beginning. And it was just, I was just outmatched because it, they're using Magic Cruiser on the dam on Shy Guy Beach. So... I am so surprised that I actually finished that one. That is crazy. Okay, let's keep going. That one took forever as well. I'll probably have like a timer to show how long it took, but I don't even know how long it took. Okay, here we go. This one should be easy. Honey Coop. I got a bike. I can wheelie. We got long straightaways. Let's go to Delfino. Okay, honestly, I could have beat that one one-handed. Feels great to just move on and get a nice little first try. DSDS out of the way, let's move on to Stadium. Okay, that took a little bit of time to get used to the cart physics again, but that one wasn't bad at all. Alright, let's see what we gotta do next, because we gotta use Waluigi Crawler. Change character. Okay, Staff Ghost is on the Tiny Titan, so I don't think this one should be too bad. We are always gonna be faster than it. The turns... The only turns that are gonna be bad are the, is like the S-Bend at the end. I'm gonna save my mushrooms for that, and see if we can do the uh, little double cut. Just kind of feel this one out. It would be like here. Oh wow, that was that was the exact same. Okay, this will be really easy. Actually, I probably don't even need to go for that again. I can just kind of keep my lead here. Could be chilling here. I got a half second lead on him. We get a mini turbo at the end. Yeah, that's easy. All right, one try with the prowler. I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay, so we're on BC3. I forgot that this was the next track. Got Dry Bowser Flame Runner. Yes! Now, 
hopefully we can just do the shortcut with this vehicle. I think without the cut, this one would be really hard. <laughs> this guy's not driving that slowly. I don't know exactly what my alignment's gonna be, but that okay. Well, shoot. We might have to practice for this for a little bit. Okay, let's try this again. Dude, what the f- <laughs> Oh no, this is not good. This is not good. I don't know how to do this, dude. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Oh no. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Just uh, mess around a little bit. It looks like maybe we just have to play off of the left tires. Okay, okay, yeah. Then we just gotta play around the left tires and act like those are the bike's tires. Like how you would normally align. It's actually not that bad when I'm, when I'm getting my mini turbos out. Okay. Go here. There we go. Ah, that's exactly what it was. My left tires were just clipping the uh, the railing. Okay, that does save a lot of time, but honestly, he's probably going to end up catching up. Eh, depends on how I drive. Although he is going to have a long straightaway to catch up here, so... We'll see how this goes. I'll probably just drive on lap 2 and then see how we are doing on lap 3. Okay, this one's also completely fine. All right, I think we should be fine to just go around. Really close, but I think our shroom spot is better than his. I'm pretty sure he just shrooms on the last straightaway. I think we got it. I think we got it. Nice little orange MT. Yeah, we definitely got it. Okay, that was uh, a little bit more challenging than I thought it would be. I don't even know where he used this mushroom. It wasn't there, so. We got that one done. Ooh, get to use... Try Bowser on the Flame Runner. Let's go, dude. About time. All right, it should be another freebie. And honestly, Flame Flyer on uh, Mario Circuits shouldn't be too bad. As long as I get good shortcuts, I feel like it should be fine there. And then, what is it? MC3 Gardens Mountain RBC. All right, get me out of the parkway. Okay, I don't think this one should be too bad unless this ghost is just cracked. And I don't think MC3 will be too bad either because Wild Wing is pretty decent. It should be able to charge MTs up pretty easily and uh, take the turn sharp. Like, look at that. We got this. Um, help, help. <laughs> uh, okay, well, luckily that ghost was really easy for some reason. Even though I completely botched the ending. Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? That is a bullet bike on my screen, baby. Yes, sir. Let's go. I still think this should be pretty easy to beat. The Wild Wind's actually a good car track with a lot of turns like this. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. Restart, restart. That means we have gardens, and I have... I have no idea what... What the heck? Okay. That means we have gardens, which I was saying, I do not know what the vehicle is there. And then DK Mountain, which I think might be Funky Kong Flame Runner? Or Flame Flyer, I mean. Either Flame Flyer or like Off-Roader or something like that. Yeah, this guy doesn't even take the shortcut. Okay, we're fine. It'd be an easy one. I don't even have to worry about driving, like, super fast. Oh, okay, he does actually cut that turn off. That's interesting. Did I just not see it correctly, lap one? I thought he took, like, the standard cut. Hmm. Either way. Pretty easy. Okay. I am very happy with what I'm seeing right now. Because I think this mini beast should be easy to beat on Peach Gardens. I mean, I'm on the bullet bike. And then DK Mountain with the mini beast should be really good. The mini beast is... Actually, a decent cart for that track. 
our carts in general are actually pretty good on that track and you can just do the uh the gap cut which i'm pretty sure the staff ghost isn't gonna do so we should be an easy dk mountain i'm literally about to lose to this cart though no he doesn't oh, okay the drift stat drift stat got me one reset oh i drifted the wrong way huh. doesn't matter And that is Peach Yardens. Who tracks to go? All right. I'm pretty sure Mountain's going to be easy. But this is going to be the last character combination reveal. Because um, he's RBC. We're not going to be able to take the combo because that's the last track. So let's see who's the last. Yeah, okay. Funky Kong Flame Flyer. That's what I thought it was going to be. Uh, I don't think this one should be difficult at all because of the cut like i said so let's just go ahead and race it see if i can do the like oh, no. that did not work oh he he took that's where he used the shroom still think using it on the bridge is probably the best spot right although i did kind of take that first turn really slowly but whatever we'll see yeah no uh wraparound strats for you baby peach Oof. Well, maybe this won't be as easy as I thought. Yeah, I'm not in control of my bike right now. I cannot lie. Neither is he. Okay, let's... Come on. Get there. That wasn't optimal, but... Okay, well, we're restarting. How do you drive this track in a cart? This is, like, miserable. I know you can get, like, good cart times here, too. I've seen it. Pretty sure the world record used to be a cart at one point. Okay, well, that's all we're gonna really need to do. Nothing else matters as long as we take the cut. Just from here. This is the widest I've ever taken that turn before in my life. And I'm off the track. Okay. Well. Eh, I still think we can maybe beat him. Uh, never mind. <laughs> okay. There we go. That's something. That's all we need to do. Literally nothing else on the track matters. Take the shortcut. It's gonna drive really safe and see what happens. Dude, I... Okay, it doesn't matter. <laughs> We're fine. Oh my god. I can't with this track, man. This track plus this cart is, like, crazy. Okay, that's really easy now, though. Figured it out. There we go. That should do it. All right, I got one more left. Ending it off with our boy Funky Kong, but on the Flame Flyer. And you know what? I don't know who the character used this. I'm pretty sure it's Bowser Jr. Uh, I think it's Bowser Jr. on the Sprinter, if I'm not mistaken. So we should hopefully be able to wrap this one up in one try. Let's get a Let's, ooh. Uh, Bowser Jr. on the Sneakster is intimidating, quite honestly. Because he pops those wheelies on those long straightaways. Like, this might be tough. We'll see. We'll see. Ah, okay. Yeah, this is going to be kind of hard to drive. I can't even lie. I'm just going to go with the standard grass cut first, because I think that should be easier and save, like, almost the same amount of time. Just getting these orange mini turbos out whenever I can. Pretty important. Okay, that was the turn that messed me up last time, but that one wasn't too bad that time, so... There we go. 
what I'm really just scared for is the well, the spiral. I should be able to get in time though, right? Should be able to. But I'm scared for the uh, just the beginning straight away. Like, oh wow, yeah, I gained a lot of time. That's nice. Also, rail shortcut potential. You know, if needed. I'm ahead by two seconds. That's actually a lot. There we go. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. This might be easy. Oh my god, I almost fell off. <laughs> Alright, now nah, we are chilling. Was not paying attention. Whew. Okay, it's fine. We got the shroom to recover. I think this is it. I think we got it. Unless I hit the fire pillar off the track, I think we got it. And honestly, thinking about it, if I looped back over to do LC with Bowser Jr. A sneakster, that would also be very easy. Sneakster's actually good at that track. And you know what? YOLO. Oh. Okay, well. Ending it off not in style, actually in quite, uh, quite an epic fail. Epic fail! But that's it. Time. I do not have a timer. I wish I did, because that took me... So much longer than I thought it would. Holy crap. I thought I was going to be able to do it in like an hour or two in one sitting. Dude. That took forever. I really feel like an idiot. Thinking back to the first, uh, the first couple tracks. Because I TT'd the first couple tracks in this fashion. Just to see how difficult it would be. And LC is on the mock bike. Luma Meadows on the bullet bike um yeah, mushroom gorge was on mini beast whatever but i did not actually test past like these three tracks so all i did was race on the flame runner the mock bike and then the bullet bike i was like oh this is gonna be easy and i did not even realize or think about how the different combinations on the different tracks were gonna be like very difficult this gb2 ghost man i cannot believe it I cannot believe I beat this GB2 ghost. That one was that one was a lot of fun. Look at them all was fun to figure out. That was also very challenging just with uh what's it called the sprinter. And then Shy Guy Beach was not fun, but it was also challenging. It was three carts. Yeah, the three carts were the most difficult. Everything else was fine. Like I just had to drive correctly and then Make it, but those three tracks in particular. Ooh. Wow. Yeah, I, I thought I was going to one try every one of them. I legitimately thought going into it that there was a chance that I could one shot beat every one of these tracks like that. Oh man, if you want a crazy challenge, do GV2 on Super Blooper. Everything else was kind of easy. Like you could see, you know, what tracks were hard and what weren't. So you can go through the full challenge if you like, but honestly, that. That GB2, the CM one was also very fun, and Shy Guy Beach. But that's it for me. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Peace.